here I am going to show you the three cases of refraction of light when the ray of light travels from a rare medium to a denser medium here this is the air and this is a glass which is a denser medium okay instead of glass we can also show water right when we show water here we will uh, illustrate with the uh, points or drops okay and will not show the solid structure as here it is shown okay so when ray of light travels from a rare medium falls obliquely then what happens it bends towards normal on the point of incident this is the point of incidence between these two medium right so it uh, travels and bends towards the normal right here this one is normal I am showing here right in this case AOO is the incident ray okay so AO is the incident ray O is the point of incidence this point OP is the refracted ray this one I have to show with an arrow okay because this shows the direction of the traveling of the ray right and this angle is 90 degree this is the angle of refraction in this case when light travels from a, from a rare medium to a denser medium then the angle of refraction that is angle r is less than angle i okay and the second case is when light travels from a denser medium to a rare medium what i am showing here it bends away from the normal right so light travels from a denser medium this is glass this is the second case and at the point of incidence we see that it bends away from the normal this is the normal and this travels away from the normal right in this case angle r will be greater than angle i okay i am not showing the angle because it is not looking better here i am showing angle r is less than angle i but here angle r is greater than angle i okay if uh, it is uh, given in the problem that the angle of refraction is greater than angle of incidence then what is the case the light it may it may be illustrated that light is traveling from a rare medium to denser medium option b the light is traveling from a denser medium to rare medium okay so you have to select the right one if you know the cases then you can easily uh, answer the question okay then the third case is when light travels from a rare medium to a denser medium it undergo refraction okay and again emerges right so this is the third case we will notice here that the light's original path was this okay it was traveling through this path but due to this slab it undergoes refraction and in the first case this is the point of incidence and it bends towards the normal and in the second case at the point of incidence between the glass and air it bends away from the normal right so what we see it follows the original path okay so a is the incident ray in the first case for this medium and for this pair of the medium op is the incident ray and pq here we can say is emergent ray right because it is emerging okay and 
one special parameter comes here in this case this is called lateral displacement right displaces that the lights didn't follow the original path it laterally displaces with a distance d this is this d is called lateral displacement okay it must be written when this case uh, will be asked to illustrate okay so these are the three cases these these are the most basic cases of the refraction of light you should remember it is very simple now the in the next video i will show you why we study refraction what is the effect of refraction okay